Hey guys, this is uh, Architect with the new uh, Dark Souls Tips video. Uh, just gonna go over some character builds and like some good things that you can do, uh, what classes to pick, because um, class is extremely important in this game. Uh, my class is Gladiator. Uh, I get a damage bonus to these, they're Studded Smashers. Um, they're a crush weapon. Uh, they're good. Uh, I, I use them a lot for like, uh, ranked PvP and uh, just, like general matchmaking. Uh, they're good for like capture the flag, especially because uh, when you when you have the flag, you can actually deal extra crush damage. Um, but here is my steel slicer and my uh, my dragon shield. Now my dragon shield isn't as good. I just kind of use it because it looks good with the steel plate armor. Um, and then you he has the uh, dark plate armor. Uh, that's why he's he's red and black. It resists light damage, as well as prong damage. If you're fighting a light damage enemy, uh, like a crusader, you it's good to wear dark plate, and if you can use prong damage, because crusaders are a weak against prong damage, uh, that's, you know, it's, it's really effective, because it basically polarizes those two archetypes. A steel slicer, uh, it upgrades into the dark slice. If you take the um, dark, uh, I think it was called the Dark Steel Path, I think. Yeah, Dark Steel Path. Um, I don't really go on that, so I'm not really familiar with it. Um, basically, it has more prong damage, and uh, it. But this one, uh, the the Steel Slicer, it has more crushing damage, and you get a damage bonus as a Gladiator. So I used it. Uh, so first off, he's got the um, Silver Dark Streaker in his hand. He's kind of got like the whole matching set thing going on because you can. Um, you, you can get, if you, if you go through the dark path, uh, the dark steel path, you can get just about anything in this color. And I think it's cool. That's one of the things in the game you get a bonus for is like matching colors and all that. Um, basically, he's got the um, dark silver streaker. And I think this is the iron defiler in his left hand. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's enchanted as well. It's got a uh, plus two defense. Uh, which is really useful if you're if you're dual wielding like that because then you don't really need a shield uh, Can you switch your weapons? All right, so he's got the black water shooter here um, Really an under underrated weapon uh, With the amount of like pierce damage and even when it's in dark steel it does prong damage as well like not a lot of people use this in, in matchmaking, but uh, when, when people do and they actually know how to use it correctly, it'll really surprise some people and his left hand, he's got, I'm not exactly clear on it. I think that's uh, Ronson's dagger. I think that's Ronson's dagger. That or Ronson's dirk. Um, Ronson, you have to kill Ronson to get it. I would recommend it. Ronson's kind of hard, uh, but he does give you some good stuff. Not only is he really hard to kill, but you're gonna be losing a lot of services that you would really need. You can get all this stuff from the Dunker Merchant in Dunker Village. Uh, that's like to the west of the Frost Peak Mountains. Uh, it's it's in a red brick house. It's you'll see it. It's it's not hard to find. I think it's at coordinate X 17 Y 13 on the map. I think that's it. And as always, uh, subscribe, rate, and comment, and flag.